what is going on. They're probably going to do an x-ray. At least we'll have a little more information. If he has a tumor, then we're going to get him put to sleep. And if the vet says there's nothing we can do, we're going to have him put to sleep. And then if he says, give me $2,000 over that because of the x-ray and the visit, I guess, then we're going to have a real dilemma because we're probably going to go for that. Make him faster, stronger. <laughs> a bionic cat. Yeah, that's it. A six million dollar cat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what well, would six million dollars from the 80s be today? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably 2,500. <laughs> <laughs> So this morning my state of denial came to an end, kind of abruptly. No evidence of any activity in the litter box, combined with a bout of vomiting in the morning. Seems that everything that he ate yesterday and seemed to be digesting returned around, what, 4 a.m.? 3. 3 a.m. So, when I got up and became aware of that, my plan for the day radically altered. State of denial ended. Reality. And I'm really glad it did because I didn't want to go all by myself. I was going to go 